Hey folks, it's Chad again. Just want to give you a quick update. Um, this is, uh, I ended up painting the boat. So our last video I did uh, was with the glue vit where I sealed the rivets um, on the bottom of the boat. And now we've painted it. So I've done the painting of the bottom from the rub rail all the way around the bottom of it. This is a Rust-Oleum topside paint. Um, you know, this boat's not going to be in the water all the time. So it's just going to be out, fish today, bring it home on the trailer, wipe it down. But I used a Battleship Gray. It's an oil-based um, paint. And I uh, used a foam roller and a tip br uh, brush method. So I'll back up here. You can kind of see um, the finish came out really nice. Uh, this is a 52-year-old boat. So, uh, um, you know, it's got some little dents and things in it. But uh, it's to be expected. It looks pretty solid. So... Um, this is how the paint job came out. It's really nice. Um, real nice shiny gloss. Now this lower area here, I just painted the bottom up to the rub rail. Um, so the rest of the boat along here uh, where the primer and the other body work I've been working on, that's going to be blue. So this area here is going to be blue. I may do a white or, or blue or black stripe above that rub rail I'm not real sure yet but this area this area will be blue here um, so yeah it's really nice product easy to work with I did uh, two coats um, you know on uh, Saturday and Sunday this past weekend uh, came out really nice really happy with it so I'm ready to flip it over and start working on the inside I'm gonna use this uh, same gray battleship gray on the inside but I'm gonna add a uh, non-skid uh, they make a non-skid packet like a sand packet for Astolium does you can buy it and then it just mixes right in with the paint um, so I'll use that on the inside of the boat on the floor so that'll be the next update thanks I hope this is helpful to you enjoy take care